Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Mr. Hino with Mr. Hino's Lego Robotics. Today's video, it's about Cargo Connect. And today my challenge is, can Mr. Hino get over 200 points with just using one hand and doing three missions? And it will be way under two and a half minutes. I'm trying to see if I can get more missions in, but today the challenge is one hand, three missions, can I get over 200 points? So if you want to see that, stay with me. No Lego Robotics. Oh yeah. Okay guys, so today it's not about showing off. It's seriously not. It's about just helping out new teams, figuring out your missions, and they don't have to be anything complicated. Um, I'm gonna try to get over 200 points today and just using my one hand. So I'm not, I'm not gonna be switching out any attachments. I'm gonna be using the same attachment. And so what I want to just encourage you by watching this video today, for the teams that are struggling with points, don't overcomplicate your missions. I mean, you guys are probably watching tons of YouTube videos where robots are doing like eight different things. You don't have to do all of those things. Obviously, you're gonna save time if you have lots of attachments switching those in and out of the launching area or your or base. But I'm just going to show you today, your programs don't have to be super difficult to get big points. So today, the challenge, again, 200 points, one hand, trying to do that in less than two and a half minutes. So if you want to see that, let's go to the table. Okay, everybody, the robot is ready. My three missions are ready. I'm not even going to worry about the time, guys, because I know this is going to be less than two and a half minutes. So I'm gonna actually walk you through each mission here. Oh, let me get my unused capacity back on here. So again, new teams, um, teams that are just trying to get, you know, your programs together. Don't overcomplicate it. Let me show you how easy this can be, okay? Let me just get my first program ready. In three, two, one, Lego. So we're gonna head over here to the cargo plane first. That is such a satisfying mission. I love that. And then we're going to get this unused out of the way. Okay. Now my next one. Oh, one hand is really tough. This next one is what I call switch green. We're going to be taking these two gray containers over to the green circle and then flipping over the switch engine. Okay. So let's check that one out. And there we go. Back in. Okay. And then this last one is what I just call trucks because it's all about getting these two platooning trucks uh, hitched. And then hopefully, I don't know, sometimes I can knock over that bridge, but we'll just check that out. We'll see if that can happen. Ooh, that's in. Oh, okay, thought I could get that. Okay, so let's add everything up here. I, you guys know I could have filled that with the time left that I have, right? So you're going to give me that 30? So 30, the door is down, the container's out, so that's another 30, that's 60. 10, 20, another bonus for the circle having containers inside, so that's another 30, that's 90. This was flipped over. For 20, that's 110. These two trucks are together, connected here to the bridge. That's 30, so that's 140. My robot definitely fits in the small inspection area, so that's 20, so that's 160. And then I didn't use any precision tokens, so that's 50. That's 210. And then I put my chicken away because my students always mess with the chicken. That's another 10. So I'm actually at 220 with three missions and one hand, guys. Okay, guys. So I did it. Over 200 points. Thank you to, you know, oh, you know what I forgot? I forgot the chicken. So I should have 220 points. I forgot. My students always mess with the chicken. So I take that off the board. 
but 220 today, one hand, and I'm hopefully going to be bringing you a better score than that because I know I can get more than that because I had more time. So today, again, not about showing off. It's just to encourage teams to not overcomplicate it, to simplify your missions. If you noticed, I didn't do that many forwards and turns, and you don't have to with some of the closer missions. Now, obviously, if you're going to want to get more points, we're going to have to venture out farther in the table. But try to just tell your team, don't overcomplicate things. Sometimes it's better just to be simpler. Okay, guys, hopefully today's video was helpful. I am Mr. Hino from Missions Lego Robotics. I'm out. He's out. He's out. We got this. We got this. We got this, guys. Hey guys, Mr. Hino here. Thank you so much for watching. And if you love robotics, don't forget to check out these videos also because they're cool. Okay guys, take care.